Tillage depth control, I mean, I've noticed a huge change. The seed depth has been very consistent this year. I like it. I mean, you're just touching the button and it goes and when you get to the headland, you hit the button and it comes up and it's you swing around and go. It's, it's pretty nice. Not every time, but more times than not, we're getting away with one pass now instead of multiple passes. We're, this automatic, we just don't worry about it. We hit the button and drop it, it does its own thing. Yeah, that tellage uh, depth control that we've got on gave us control. I can put any driver in it. We get the same depth going across the field. We've got variable soils. So it works great for us. Um, I'm really impressed with uh, how well it works. It's definitely worth the money. Definitely have no fuel savings because it's just, um, we figured about 10 to 12% less fuel burnage with running the TDC with not running TDC. On the fuel, we're make, it makes a hell of a difference. Yeah, we're saving a lot. It's relatively foolproof to throw someone in the tractor and you don't have to watch it quite as closely. You keep it at that three inches, it's gonna stay there, period. You're about two and a half, three inches deep all the way across. And you don't have ripples, and you don't have this going through the field. It just maintains that nice, perfect depth. Ease of using it is, is key. It's, uh, it's very uh, user-friendly. I feel like it's pretty simple, um, very user-friendly, and just a breeze. Anyone can drive it. You, you don't worry about people going too deep with it, no matter who's driving it. I know all day long it's going to be at two or two and a half inches, whatever I set it at. Consistent depth. It's working pretty good. The better seed bed because we're only working two inches and the ground's not getting dried out. Then we can put the planter down, put the seed where we want it. Everybody knows if you have even emergence on your seed, you have a better crop yield. It's, and it's worth that. Last year we saw a lot of sandy ground that the uh, one pass tool really dug really deep. We had trouble with seed being too deep. Um, this year it's just been very consistent through all types of ground very uh, even emergence all the way across. We actually even did a trial where we were looking at uh, one row of corn and we counted how many came up on day one, two, and three, and uh, very pleased with how even it was coming up. A lot of that had to do with, I think, the depth control. It's universal. It don't matter if I want to put it on a field cultivator, I want to put it on a high speed disc, low speed disc, an old junker chisel plow out of the fence row, it can go on anything, and it can go on any tractor. And a matter of fact, uh, we're so impressed we put it on a, another implement this year. I'm recommending it to everyone I talk to. Now we've got two of them and probably going for a third one.